Hello. Okay, two people have asked me um, regarding the last video. I showed my crystals and I asked some questions there. Two people have said to me, um, what would my answers be to those questions? One of them said, I'd be very, very interested, interested um, to hear what your answers would be regarding these questions. So, I thought I would do it. And I haven't given it any thought. Subconsciously, probably there's some answers in there because I've, I've written the just the questions down. And the questions were, um, I think they were in this order, not their matters. So the questions were, um, would you rather be happy, interesting or rich? Um, I'm not interested in being rich. Money's, you know, never played a part in my life. So would I rather be happy or interesting? I think we're all interesting in lots of different ways and probably I'm interesting to some people but not to others and other people are interesting to me but not to others so the answer to that is very very simple and it's happy I want to be happy you know <laughs> that's what I want to be all my life I want to be happy so would you rather be happy interesting or rich happy without any shadow of a doubt happy question two is what age would you be if you could choose any age I think I've said this in the video before, I would like to um, go back and do all my schooling um, and my first day at work and then the education that I kind of taught myself from leaving school. I'd like to go back, um, I don't know what age, 12 maybe? I'd like to go back to being 12 but know what I know now. Sorry to put that clause there. That wasn't in the question, but yeah, if I knew what I knew now, how different the world would be. Um, so yeah, what age would you be if you could choose any age? Yeah, about 12, why not? Um, if you could live, if you could relive five minutes of your life, what five minutes would you choose? I would choose a very distant memory. When I was a little boy, uh, me and my brother went to some coastal sort of resort somewhere or other and we belly ached and moaned and whinged and whined because there was a speedboat there that you could ride on and it was, you know, pay a few quid and have a ride or whatever, a few pence probably actually in them days. When we went to get on there, the guy said, sorry, you must be accompanied by an adult and there was only my mum with us. My mum was scared of water, scared of boats. Those two things she hated. And she paid and she got on that boat. And I'm so pleased and proud that my mum did that. And we went quite fast. And uh, I remember at one stage we sort of banked to the right. And we loved it. And my mum screamed right off. Screamed and screamed and screamed. She didn't like it at all. Um, but I would live that five minutes again. If I could. How do you want to be remembered? Well, everybody's going to answer this the same, really, you know. How do I want to be remembered? Um, I think... I'm not really bothered, actually, about being remembered, to be honest. I don't know whether that sounds awful, maudlin, morbid. I don't know what it sounds. It doesn't really matter, you know. Um, I'm nothing. We're all nothing, you know. Um, I'm here today. One day I won't be. That's that. It doesn't matter. But how do I want to be remembered? Well, it's not a want, really, but how do I want to be remembered is I would like to think that people um, can think he, he was OK. He was he was quite nice. Something like that. Um, yeah, that would do. Yeah. But I was OK. That's how I'd like to be remembered. What is your biggest regret? I told you I haven't thought about these. What is my biggest regret? Obviously I try not to live with a, with a bundle of regrets following me around because we do good things, bad things, indifferent things and what have you. And there's certain things I wish I would have done maybe slightly differently. 
or and there's some things I wish I hadn't done at all. But what is my biggest regret? I probably no. I my biggest regret is I wish I was a better son to my mum. I wish that I didn't bring her so much hassle. Um, I was a little bit wayward, you know, and it used to cause my mum a lot of worry, a lot of troubles and problems, I think. I wish I was a better son to my mum. That's my biggest regret. One piece of advice um, the younger you would give yourself now. It's probably what I've been saying in the videos, really. Other people's opinions of me is none of my business. So I think the one piece of advice that the younger person, the younger me, would give to me now is don't care what other people think. Never, ever give it a, a flying thought. Don't care what other people think. That is the one piece of advice little me would give to big me. Uh, what is your dream? Uh, it's not one this isn't it what is your dream because you can answer it two different ways is it an inwardly personal dream or is it just a, a whatever dream my real dream is that the whole world wakes up to the rubbish that is religion politics wars you know, governments my biggest dream, what is your dream? I would dream that the whole world learns to live in peace, harmony, love, bliss, joy. You know, everybody gets on. That is my biggest wish. You know, a beautiful world with beautiful people. That is my dream. If it's an inwardly dream, I don't know. I think I've done everything really and probably ten times over. Um, so maybe on a personal level I can't answer that your dream but if I have to answer it um, what is my dream that I suppose that I, I get into bricks fairly soon um, my, my, okay my dream would be a little dream bungalow in a little quiet village with lovely views where I could just live a very quiet peaceful little life you know listen to music writing poetry doing my art walking my dog meditating, chilling out, um, on a personal level, that probably would be my dream, I would imagine. Two more. Uh, what would you like to change about yourself? What would I like to change? Okay. I wish I didn't have osteoarthritis. More than that, I wish I didn't have the pain that I have. If I could take that away, if that wasn't with me, my life would actually be better. So what would you like to change about yourself? I, I wish that I didn't have constant pain. And the last one, it says, if you could have any one question answered with the truth, what would that be? If I could have any one question, what would that one question be? Answer with the truth. Who really runs this world? Who really runs governments? Who runs the royal family? Who is it really? If the truth was told, then yeah, I might ask that question. Who runs governments? Who really runs it? You know, people in America think that Obama was in charge. I don't want to say Trump because I think most of the world agrees he's a clown. People in America thought that Bush was in charge. People in the UK thought Wanky Moonface was in charge. People now think that Theresa May, that vile old hag, is in charge. They're not. They're just puppets. So who runs them? Who is in charge? Who is the power? That's what I would ask. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed that. And I've been honest as much as I can. Take care. Be well.